The train of e-ink products never seems to stop. We've seen a whole bunch of stuff in the industry, basically everything and everybody adopting e-ink and electronic paper. So why not NFC tags? Now we've seen NFC tags from multiple different manufacturers like SES and Magatag e-ink themselves, and they're mostly just kind of test kitty. No one really has packaged one up quite as good as this. This is Hanvon. Hanvon has made e-readers in the past. In fact, they were one of the first color e-readers ever made back in 2010. This is the Hanvon M card. This thing is NFC updatable via their application, we'll show you in a bit, because this is an unboxing and review all in one. We're not just going to unbox this because there's so little to this unit that it wouldn't really warrant its own video. So we're just going to take the plastic off for the first time here. You can see you can download the applications from the back of the box via QR codes if you want and we will open up this little tiny box. I don't even think there's gonna be USB in here because you don't need to charge this. No, there isn't. So here is the device itself. Now, this is the whole thing. It has a little information at the bottom, serial number, a loop for the little thing they give you here. It's like a little style, um, it's like a, you know, those phone charm loops. And then the screen here, there is no user interactability, meaning you can't touch it. It's not touch screen. There's no swipe. It's not capacitive. It's not resistive touch, nothing. This is a passive unit, which means you utilize things like your phone and it's NFC to tap it to the back and it will update with whatever you want based on the application. Now this is Hanvon. So again, this is a major brand back this in the past we've seen some things you can just buy on eBay and Ali and they're they're just you don't know what to do with them but they've packaged this for you both literally and figuratively they've packaged it in a way where you can download the application and use it to its full potential now how do we use this well now we have to go over to the phone if you scan the one on the right, it will be WeChat that will download and open up. If you scan this one on the left, this one will immediately automatically start downloading the HW ebook application APK that you're going to need to utilize this. Unfortunately, the app is only going to be in Chinese, but there's only five things and it's not a huge learning curve. So tapping the bottom left corner is your settings. Now you can choose this, which is just turn on your NFC. So that's that. And this just changes the color of the app itself. No, it will not reflect the color of the M card. This is not tricolor like the SES Omega tag. This is only black and white. So that's that. Clicking here allows you to write, choose pictures, phone number, or a scan QR our code right there. So what we're going to do is just do something simple and just write something. So we'll go here and type in good e-reader space x Hanvon. I wonder if we can space that out. We can. Okay, so we'll go with that. So we're going to go with that and press back. You do have a few things you can do. You can center it, you can justify it to either of the sides, and you can change the font styles as well. Once you have that written, grab your card, make sure you have your NFC on, tap the back, and it's going to think for a little bit. Just let it do its thing. Don't move the, the, the Hanvon tag. And then it will have updated right there. So now it says Goody Reader X Hanvon. Again, you can't change this. There's no strings attached. There's no wireless connectivity that is a constant. NFC is a one shot deal. You tap the thing, it's used to scan in your, your smartwatch, like your Sony smart band, or it's used to update things or transfer data in an instant. It's not a, it's not a constant connection like Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. So you can update it to many different things just by doing that. Secondly, we'll go over to images and what we will do is pick an image from our phone's gallery. Now something to note, if you want to put a picture of your kids or something like my son here, I'm going to go here and I'm going to click OK, but you can see how bad it looks because this has terrible resolution. If you're going to use something like a full image from your phone, you are going to be set up for disappointment because it's not going to look very good. It's going to look very sloppy and a lot of the detail is going to be gone. So this is kind of reserved for something a little bit more simplistic. So actually what we're going to do is use the actually guy because this guy is hilarious and it's very low res. So when we put that up against the unit with NFC now, 
And once that's done, there he is, your best friend. So when it comes to simple stroke kind of images and something with a little bit less depth and you know less backgrounds it can be keyed out a lot easier so with the first photo had a lot of you know the, the blue sky and the cherry blossoms and everything there's too many layers and the, the 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 shadows and the highlights weren't coming through so it will be reserved for something a little bit easier like this thirdly we can do phone numbers you click on this and it'll go through all the contacts in your phone i'm not going to show you that because there's some sensitive contacts but we're going to show you what the end result looks like so this guy doesn't exist anymore, so feel free to call it. What you do is you click on a contact, then you put your M card up against the back, let it do its thing, and much like any other NFC transmission, it immediately puts it on your card right there. And the fourth one being a little bit more customizable. So what you can do is say, what is this? And you can add a picture as well by going to your gallery. I just chose a little cartoon tree and then put what is this next to it. Put your NFC tag up against the back. Exact same process for each individual section. And you'll get a nice little tree with what is this. So you can really customize what you want to put on your tag. The only other thing you can do with the app is click on the history and it'll show you all the things you've just done. Now this is really nice and we like this because this is the first time, if you've skipped ahead, that this has been packaged for you. There's an app, there's the unit itself, it has a recognizable brand name, it's very simple to use. Yes, it's only in Chinese, but as you've seen from this video, you can write whatever you want on here. This thing is completely customizable, obviously, it is. that's the entire purpose of the M card is to be customizable and it is very there's no learning curve it's simple it's simple processes it doesn't require photo editing it's a fantastic buy and just a cool novelty to have around it's very much recommended you can get it from the good e-reader store and will ship anywhere in the world for you so for a full unboxing and review of the Hanvon M cards by Hanvon themselves this is Goody Reader and this is Peter